So my last week here in Nakata Bay was kind of rough. We have a policy in the world race, and I have a policy that after two days of feeling sick, you must seek out medical treatment. So I was feeling kind of rough one one day. Had a fever. Next day, still had a fever. Next day, also happened to be Easter. Happy Easter. And we planned on doing an Easter service out on the deck for Easter, but it's raining. And I'm also really sick. Uh, our host came in and she was also feeling kind of rough. She had just taken a malaria test. She, so she administered a malaria test to me and I came back negative. So she gave me doxy and I went on my way. Today marks day three of this fever. I think, oh, I have antibiotics that I'm taking, but I'm still not doing real hot. Actually, I'm really hot. Oh, you can see it fog up because that's how hot I am. Wow. Good morning. Yesterday was by far the worst day. <sighs> My God, I didn't even feel good in the morning. I was so cold, but plus it was raining, and luckily my tent has been very, very dry during this very, very rainy month, and that is very, very awesome, because I've spent more time in my tent probably than outside my tent the last four days. Yesterday was bad, I couldn't even eat for the most part. Lots of tossing and turning. My body temperature was the hottest it's ever been. I'm taking Doxy now. I was taking Delta Prim before, which is a form of Doxy, but now I'm taking Doxy on the regular. Plus, um, ibuprofen, plus a CPAC. Just pill popping at this point. But last night I woke up somewhere around 7 and everything I was wearing was soaked in sweat. Like I dunked it in the river or something. My shirt is still wet. My pillow is still wet. Like as if you had dumped it in the river. River. Lake. I've, I'm still not all the way here. I don't think I'm completely better yet, but I've definitely turned a corner as of now. I need to take a shower. I need to wash this blanket. It's kind of disgusting when I think about it. How many times I've sweat through it. I'm going to try not to think about it. Fourth day, I was pretty decent. I thought I had kind of crested this thing and I was coming down. <laughs> Boy, was I wrong. <laughs> so we're on day, wait. One, two, three, four, five. Is this six? Oh no. Yeah, this is day six. And I still have a fever. So I made a deal with Emily that if I still felt bad in the morning, we'd go to the hospital. We're on our way now. So we're leaving the hospital now. And they are just dumbfounded as I am. My blood tests come out completely okay. So I just have more antibiotics. 
like five days of it now. I hope I'm better by travel day. <sighs> so the hospital doesn't help at all. They don't tell me anything. I take a blood test, my blood comes back perfectly fine. So I'm completely bewildered, and so is everybody else at this point. And I'm still fevering greatly. <sighs> so the word on the street is, I have malaria. So after the hospital took a nap, woke up three hours so hot, I checked my temperature for the first time. I was kind of nervous to do that. I knew I was really high. 103 Fahrenheit. So they tested me for malaria one more time. And it was positive. It was slight, but it was positive. So I have these meds now. And these painkillers. I should be better. Three days. Mm. I think I forgot to mention they got me a dorm. The team did. So I didn't have to sleep in the rain anymore. And on an actual bed. Uh, so I'm all packed up now. Oh gosh. I need to go take a shower. A cold shower. But once I got the meds, everything, everything became okay. Welcome to day seven. I'm being sick. I feel better. More betterer. The fever's kind of gone. Well, I still got two more days of medication. After you saw me last, things only got way worse. Um, I waited till dinner was served, and then I went straight to bed. <laughs> last night was just really weird. I was in a dorm on the bottom bunk and I thought it had rained because it was raining during the night. I thought it had rained on my bed but then I woke up in a pile of my own sweat. So hey! <laughs> um, but I'm feeling better. I'm still kind of like worn out but the fever is... The fever's kind of gone. Well, I don't know. I feel kind of clammy-ish. But yeah. Everybody's off at ministry and I'm here. Hey look, I finally made it. The last little pills of this malaria medication that I'm taking. This is it, this is the last little bit. Ah, I didn't go down all the way the first time. It's okay. I made it. Now I get to mark this off. This is so exciting. Oh wait, I already had it opened. This is really embarrassing. Yes. <sighs> so yesterday was day seven, I think. That means today is day eight. First day, no pills. And guess what? I feel great. I really do. I don't think I'm quite at 100% yet, so we'll check again tomorrow. But it feels so good not to have malaria and not to be fevery. It's still hot as all get out. Um, so I'm gonna still take it easy because I was out for the count. So here I am, two days after meds. Golden, thank you very much. Wow, please take your malaria meds and don't get malaria. But I was taking my malaria meds. That's the crazy thing, I don't understand. But malaria is not fun. It like, it boils your blood and then you think you're fine after one of it. Cause that, in one of those days I thought I was peachy keen. Come back and then it hits you like a ton of bricks. That's not fun whatsoever. Ugh. <sighs> oh, my team was great. I'm in a dorm now, that's nice. <laughs>
but it's, yeah. Oh, I'm really glad to have got rid of this before travel day. Laundry's done, everything's good, ready to go. Bam, 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 bam! Next country is the Ukraine, and that is gonna be awesome. But Africa, this was nice. I'm sorry I got sick on our last little outing, but I had to experience the one disease you have that no one else has. Yeah! <laughs>